Hi guys, we have a notification from Government of Tamil Nadu Teachers Recruitment Board for the post of lecturers in Government Polytechnic Colleges. I hope the information will be helpful for you. Give a like, share and subscribe my channel. And after watching the video, if you meet the required eligibilities, hurry up to apply. Applications are invited from eligible candidates for direct recruitment for the post of lecturers in Government Polytechnic Colleges and Special Institutions. And here the name of post and scale of pay, lecturers in government polytechnic colleges and special institutions, pay 56,102, 1,77,500, postcode 19PT, total vacancies 1060. Important dates, so date of notification 27-11-2019, date of commencement of application through online mode, it is 22 January 2020. Okay, already applications are started. Last date for submission of application through online mode that is uh, February 12, 2020. Date of a computer based examination and certificate verification will be announced later. Next, we are going to check uh, shortfall vacancies 2 and current vacancies 1058, total 1060. So, just check here the current vacancies and the shortfall vacancies and the total vacancies for that means subject wise vacancies. Okay. Civil Engineering and uh, Mechanical, Electrical and you just check Electronics and Communications, Computer Engineering and just check all of your category wise or subject wise vacancies here. English, Mathematics, Physics, Chemistry and Modern Office Practices. So here category wise vacancies, just check it. And uh, now we are going to check another important information. So here we have reservations too. Qualifications, age limit candidates should not have completed 57 years as on 1-7-2019, okay. Educational qualifications, candidates should possess the following qualification on the date of notification, that is a lecturer in engineering subjects, a bachelor's degree in the appropriate branch of engineering, technology, architecture with not less than 60% of marks or equivalent. Provided that if the candidate has a master's degree in the appropriate branch of engineering, technology, architecture, the candidate should possess a first class or equivalent in the appropriate branch either at bachelor's or master's degree level. Okay, right. And uh, lecturer in non-engineering subject a first class master's degree in the appropriate branch of uh, study. Okay, candidate should possess the requisite qualification in relevant uh, subject awarded by an university or institution recognized by University Grants Commission. Okay, right. Now, so equivalent qualifications here, uh, non-engineering subjects, chemistry, MSc applied chemistry and university offered Gandhi Gram Rural University. So just check all other subjects and equivalent subjects and university offered. Okay, so just check all of them. And next important information we are going to check. So, how to apply? So, read carefully how to apply section given in the advertisement. Candidates should apply only through online mode in the Teachers Recruitment Board website. So, trb.tn.nic.in. Okay. A valid email ID and mobile number of candidate are mandatory for registration and email ID should be kept active for any further correspondence. Here, no modifications will be allowed after the last date specified for applying through online. Here, as no correspondence regarding change of particulars will be entertained at any cost, use separate email ID and mobile number for each application. That means you can apply more than one, okay, more uh, for more than one and examination fee here. 600 rupees for all candidates except a SC, SCA, ST and person with disability. For SC, SCA, ST and person with disability candidates, the examination fee is 300 rupees. And online payment to be made only through payment gateway, net banking, credit card or debit card. Offline mode of payment in any form such as demand draft, postal order etc. will not be acceptable and the candidate have also to pay the service charges as applicable for online payment. Scheme of examination, here the computer based examination will consist of a single paper of 3 hours duration with 150 MCQs 
your main subject one mark questions hundred two mark questions forty general knowledge one mark questions ten so here total one fifty okay maximum mark one ninety and duration three hours okay so the questions in the main subject will be on the subject for which the candidate has applied for and the question paper for all subjects will be of objective type with multiple choice questions in english version only the syllabi for the subjects can be downloaded from the teachers recruitment board official website just visit it okay so thank you very much i hope the information will be helpful for you